Hey guys, it's Tracy, and my channel is Tracy from the Mermaid Cove. It's Saturday morning, I'm going to work, and um, I, I'm getting Chinese food for a friend tonight, so that will be good for lunch tomorrow, so I didn't cook, but I made some um, eggs with spinach and some pepper and a little bit of cheese, so I can have a couple bites now. Not very really ladylike, but then who wants to be ladylike? I have some a little bit of uh, salad left, so eggs are gonna be so good. I'm not not a hundred percent fan of spinach in my eggs, but it's a good way to get veggies, right? So it makes sense to do it. I was going through it, look at this, my little 11 year old self with my pigtails, y'all. Love me some pigtails. So cute. Yeah, so Claire's upset. I know that girl, she slept all day. She didn't come hang out with me at all until dinner time. So, right, y'all, that's okay. She's a master manipulator. I have to head up, head out soon. Y'all, tomorrow I have to show you where I caulked because where these ants are coming in. So does that mean they'll come in somewhere else? I don't know. I have my little hotel outside for them, but, and the floor's a little wet, so I don't know if rain's coming or what, but anyway, I got some caulk from someone to use in an art project. How handy was that? So, yeah. Just struggling through y'all. Make today a good day. Got my handy dandy Winnie the Pooh. The bees are getting suspicious. Getting suspicious. I'm thinking about starting a um a, do another like what I have in my closet. Should I keep it? Should it stay or should it go? So I love this pattern because I have a picture of my dad in a shirt with this. I've had that his shirt for a while. I'm pretty sure it's in my fabric. And then I just found a picture of my mom wearing something like this because, you know, it was very 1950s. It's a little big, but anyway, I'm going to try it today and see. It's an old, old, old one from a company called Silhouette, which I think they were bought out or, I mean, I don't think that company exists the way it did. So why does this make me so flippin' happy? So I did a few things yesterday, so I'm not going to be hard on myself because that's got to change. But I made these little booklets, which I'll show you tomorrow, maybe, or Monday. But um, this was a little book, that book, like a little cookbook that I had, I was a long, long time ago, I was involved in different um, collaborations. You mail them around. It's so much fun. And this was for a company called Art Chicks. So it was nine... September 2004, because I feel like all the artwork isn't mine, but so it was kind of falling apart. So I redid it and I did it in other books, which I'm super, super hot. Love them, love them, love them. So that kind of consumed me yesterday. And I guess, you know, when you're not functioning the way you want to, it's better to do no harm, right? First, do no harm. I wanted to shop online so bad, y'all, so bad but it distracts me and I'm trying to figure out like, what is that about? Is that dopamine hit? So I gotta get my dopamine hit, y'all, other places. Anyway, look at this, just this box of goodness, right? Like why, I just shop in my own house, y'all. Look at this, this is just a bunch of goodness, right? Some Tamu stuff. So why do I need to be going but all oh, the Tamu have been, so I'm like, okay, you can look at stuff. You can throw it on your um, cart, but you're not ordering it, but keep on shining. But y'all, um, yeah, I gotta go through this with y'all separately. Yeah, but I didn't. 
I didn't. I ordered two things from Amazon. I got this white pen because all mine are not working. I tested them. And a little tiny, um, a smaller stencil set since I'm on fire. Normally I would have gotten three or four, but I didn't. I got one. So why don't I play with that, right? Now I'm obsessed with like um, cloth paper, handmade paper, textured paper, uh, which I don't think I have. I might have some like flower paper, y'all, but I don't have a lot of that. But anyway, so I'm a cart thinking about it, but can't pull the trigger, trigger because I'm having a crappy day. But you know what? It's up to me. I did the best I could. Did not drink enough water, y'all. I don't know what it is. I don't know. I think when I have some low-grade depression, I don't want to drink water. So, but I'm going to work really hard at it today. Okay, I'm off to work, and I'm going to add my morning uh, up the kitchen. My dishes are in the dishwasher. Y'all, I use... Uh, let me find this. Show you guys. Hello. So I got this um, glisten. I think I've done it before, y'all. It really cleaned my dish. I didn't feel like my dishes were getting clean. So um, I don't know if you should do this once a month or what, but I' gonna get another one. I love it. It really made a difference. All sparkly and shiny in there. All right, guys, you have a great one, and I'll check. Hey okay, guys, soon. welcome to my new series. Should it stay or should it go? So I have plus size. This is an older top. Um, it's a size three, I think, from Silhouette, which is a company that I think was bought out by another company. But anyway, I love the pattern. It's very summer. My parents both had a shirt like this, you know, in the 1950s. So what do y'all think? Um, I know the sizing's bad. Could I take it in? That's always the question, y'all. But what, what do you think? Should it stay or should it go?